So from a teacher's perspective, I think what is most exciting other than seeing the development of your students is really creating these learning environments which are really serve to be like the third teacher in the classroom. Um, it really enlivens learning, it really shows so much about children's processes and it really encourages collaboration. It encourages them to go beyond um, that which is natural to that very edge of what they know and what could be. And it's, there's so much more than copying a model off the board. It's really like puzzling and figuring out what one needs to do or how something works and having different ideas and trying them out and learning that that's what, that's what gathering data is. That's what developing a hypothesis is. And if children can l learn the name Tyrannosaurus Rex, you know, they can certainly learn what a hypothesis is. And really, they're developing vocabulary and thought processes which help them to then really add to that framework as they go on in years. Uh, the environment is also um, really connects children to nature, which is something in an urban environment is so very, very important. Um, and we don't restrict children from going inside and outside. We teach them how to go responsibly outside and in, in an environment where one needs to wear a sun hat all the time and will get reminded what, if you don't wear a sun hat, um, children learn very quickly that if they want to go outside, they need to wear their sun hat, whether they're three or whether they're 10. Uh, they learn to equip themselves with what they need. So that's adding to executive functioning ability. That's adding to their independence. That's something else that's another box they can tick off while they're doing their cognitive exercises. So again, we have a very complex learning environment, but it does meet them where they are. These are developmentally appropriate, and uh, these are exercises that are really fashioned almost to the class themselves. So it's the teacher's responsibility to really map the uh, common core learning standards, but the approaches are really tailored almost in a bespoke fashion to the class.